Hello, Bill Molyneux here. Fast Play War Games, Nottingham War Gaming Group. And uh, I have uh, taken some time to set up my game of the Box Rebellion. I'll be playing this on April 15th in the Hawks War Gaming Group. And I just wanted to set it up and see how it looks. I'll be mar using Mark um, Fasto's uh, campaign booklet. And the scenario I'm using is the HisQ Arsenal. 54 millimeter scale. And let's just take a little look at the table. I'm going to try to keep this under three minutes. Some of these figures were gifted to me by Dave Reiner. Um, from the Great Box Rebellion game we played last year in April. That was the 26 foot long mega game in the uh, on the back deck. So here's our boxer forces and uh, let's see what's inside the arsenal. Well it uh, looks like Prince Tuan is in there. So we have this arsenal needs to be taken. Um, this table is actually six by five. The table I'll be using on Friday night will actually be um, 10 feet, I believe, by um, six feet. Um, cool thing here is we have some tiger men. Tiger men are interesting. In the Box Rebellion, Righteous Harmonious Fists, the tiger men dressed up as tigers. So, we do have some boxers armed with with uh, firearms. And then we have four guns defending the arsenal. Several units of boxers armed with the muskets. And then our western forces. Well, hopefully I you won't get too bored, but we have a British unit of 12 figures. A Japanese unit. Of 12 figures painted by Jim Shaw. I need to touch them up a little bit here and there. Um, we have some Buffalo Soldiers. I guess the 9th or 10th. African American kick butt soldiers from the Indian Wars brought over to help out in China. Then we have some regular United States Marines. We have a Gatling gun and its crew, a heavy gun with a four-man crew, and uh, we've got two units of Legionnaires. And these are the 3D printed Lewis guns that my friend Josh printed for me, and I cut out the rifles of the Legionnaires and uh, converted them to be Lewis gunners. I'm quite proud of those. So i got a couple Lewis gunners in the uh, French ranks. And last but not least, the Russians. So we have the Russian units. I'm a few Russians short. So we have a few Frenchmen uh, lending a hand to fill out the brigade. Well, we're over three minutes. The rules are going to be a, a simple beer and pretzel rule system. I'm going to go over that really quick before I call it a day on this video. So these rules are inspired by A Gentleman's War, Howard Whitehouse. And this, of course, is about as boiled down as you can get. And hopefully the uh, guys will like this game of who do, you know, will be playing it. Uh, 54 millimeter is an interesting scale in wargaming. Um, most people are gaming in the 28s, 15s, and there's a lot of people were gaming in 6mm now. As far as the, uh, the rules, they're a lot like bolt action in a way. You roll the hit, and then you roll for effect. And some people would call that a saving throw. The second page is just hand-to-hand -hand combat. Quick thing on checking for morale. A few odds and ends. Well... That's about it. We're way over three minute mark. So I'm going to say uh, my standard uh, goodbyes of stay safe, be kind, and be courteous. And thank you for watching my videos.